I've done a lot of beautiful arrangements with living flowers and for some reason the paper flowers are just stimulating me more right now. My paper flowers are a lot different than most people's out there because they are restrained and more natural. They come from a place that's definitely inspired by nature. I have two little boys, Dante and Mick. They both love to make paper flowers, and my oldest son, Dante, has offered to take over the family business of paper flower making when I get old. They both like to come down and make a huge mess and play in the tissue paper and tape all the wire together and stuff, but I think I'm gonna have two pretty good helpers. Part of what makes a really good floral designer is being able to not control the flowers. I'm not trying to make one incredibly perfect, obnoxious red rose. That, that wouldn't be appealing to me. I'd want to make a beautiful branch on a rose bush that's in bloom and it's dying. I find much more beauty in that. <laughs> 